Like, share, subscribe. I'm here to talk about Kawhi Leonard. Um, should he retire if um, he get injured again? And if they don't make it to the finals and he still get injured again, um, if he don't make it to the players, the playoffs, if he get injured again, um, if he get injured, period, should he retire? What do I think he should do? If he get injured again, he 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 do this is what he do every year. Get injured every year. But um I think he should retire if he get injured again this year. Um I seen reports and from I seen from watching other people videos um that they say he should be back um at Christmas or before Christmas. Um I don't know who he playing against, but I'm I'm sure he would ain't gonna he'd probably be against Luca probably. You know Luca gonna give him the business like always in the whole Clipper team. Um Yeah, if he don't um get it done this year they should just think about trading him and blowing up the whole team like they done in the past cuz they been they they got the amount of years on that team to win the championship all they shown for the whole time they that he been on the clippers that he been injured and not being able to play or um they get he get injured and then um they end up losing. It's always an excuse for his injuries that people try to make for him. I understand everybody get injured, but if you can't be productive on the tip, I mean on the on the um court, you might should retire because you ain't shown no activity on the court. You just keep getting injured and not being able to perform. I don't want to call him Shake Legs because I already did it on the other videos. I know he's getting old, but he ain't going to get old to me. But that's what he is. But at least um, LeBron got a championship in L.A. Even though he, he been missing the um, playoffs, they been making the playoffs, the Clippers. I can say for that. But he ain't been off of the strength off of um, Kawhi Leonard. And then from role players, um, taking them to the um, playoffs like Patrick Babley and uh, Reggie Jackson and stuff. And um, Morris, one of the Morris twins. It ain't been because Kawhi Leonard led the team to the playoffs. It always be the role players. And um, the coach, Ty Lue, even though I, I ain't really think Ty Lue was a good coach. I was really believing the hype that um, Kyrie said about him that he wasn't really a good coach. He just listened to LeBron and he do whatever LeBron tell him to do. I was really believing the hype what um, Kyrie was saying about him. But um, this year, if they don't get it done, they might should just look to blow up the team. Start over. I I don't care what anybody say if they disagree with it, but it, it's just reality. It's just the guy is always injured. Somebody point out a fact. He ain't, he ain't been able to stay on the court since he's been on since he's on the Spurs. After that, he been injured the whole time. Everywhere he go. He ain't really been in that many places, but the point, he he always injured. You can't never just play a whole season or at least half the season. Like, it, it seems like he get more injured in the playoffs. That's where it happens. He got injured when he's playing against the Denver Nuggets. He got injured when he's 
um, playing against the Jazz last year. I, I think the Devers Nuggets game that is in the uh, the uh, pandemic um, tournament, and he got injured. That's how they end up losing to the Denver Nuggets because he, he his injury uh, sustained his way to perform on the court. But um, that's why I think about Kawhi Leonard. If he don't get it done this year, they might should say bye bye to him and and the fans, uh, of the Clipper fans. And I'm out.